Ryan, a fantastic result here at Mandon Sports Hub, 4-1 at full time. What are your thoughts after beating Cheltenham? Um, yeah, it was. Uh, I didn't think we actually played that well in the first half. A um, little bit sluggish, I think, and that's probably down to the battle we were in on Thursday. So, um, but credit to the girls. I said to them at half time, "You've come in three one up, and we haven't really played that well." Um, so, clinical in front of goal today. Created lots of chances. Um, Choked them set up exactly how we expected them to. We knew pacing behind would cause some problems, and like you say, so yeah, girls executed the game plan well. So, and it's nice to get out the bottom. Too, so We move up to ninth now after that. Before we talk about the league position, I just sort of talk about that first half. It was quite ropey, I suppose, on the sidelines. 1-0, then 1-all. What was it like once Lily's goal went in and also Amber's shot ended up getting tipped in? Yeah, so, um, I thought, like you said, I thought we started OK. Took, took the first goal. A um, little bit of sloppy defending for, to let Cheltenham. Cheltenham probably controlled large spells of the first half with the ball but didn't really cause us loads of problems so and let's say Lily took a unbelievable strike and good finish and then Amber's had a great effort keepers done well to tip it to the bar has come back and she's a little bit unfortunate it's hit her on the back of the head and gone in so um, just settled us a bit I think um, and we said to the girls at half time we just need to we don't need to score again really we just need to make it difficult make sure the ball's in front of us all the time and I thought they excluded that second half superbly and then Shah come on and uh, got our rewards for our work up front as well. Looking at this week, it's been very close quarters in terms of games. You know, we got the result on Thursday and today obviously getting another result. That's five goals scored, one conceded. Going into the next month, how confident do you feel that the girls can take what they've got from this week and apply it to those future games? Um, they've just got a belief in themselves. So we, like we said, they're a good side. Um, we have got a tough March. We're away all four games so, and we've got three of the top four in that month as well so we've just got to go there give a good account of ourselves go there with the belief that we can get more points on the board and like I say I think the last two games what, what's been good is the fight and the battle and the heart and desire to want to win games and it's been nice to see that. You yeah, you mentioned it there the character of the team in this week has been phenomenal going into that dressing room uh, twice this week what's it been like what is there is there a belief of that you can take the game to anyone now after this week? Yeah, I think we've had that confidence all the way through. We've said we will get out of the trouble we got ourselves into at the start of the season and we were probably unlucky to be down there anyway in terms of we've played good football. I think we've been better than a lot of teams and just unlucky in the results. So um, we can start looking up now. So we've got games and hands on team above us still as well. Um, if we look at the league table, I think Billericke has sat in fifth and we're only five points with a game in hand on them and got to play them. So why can't we start looking up and closing the gap on those teams above us. Well, the first game uh, that we have of March is against Ipswich. Last time we played Ipswich, it didn't go quite according to plan. Is there an element of revenge per, uh, going into that game? It was similar last year, playing them at home park. I think it suits Ipswich. They have a good football inside. They pop the ball around, so on a nice pitch at uh, home park suited them. So, And we, we only lost 2-0 last year there and give a good account. So probably could have nick the point if we took our chances so we'll go there like you say execute game plan hopefully and get a positive result in Ipswich next week well all the best for next week Ryan but congratulations for today no it's cheers Jake